Hello YouTube, welcome back to Camp Collab is where I collab with other artists to make something happen. Yeah. You are in the second part of this video editing tutorial. Um, a lot of people have asked me before, where did I start in photography? Actually, I didn't start in photography, I started in film. Uh, I graduated uh, with a degree in film uh, back in X amount of years and I'm glad I did because uh, I learned uh, storytelling and now I use this storytelling um, in my photographs and everything else in my art. And without further ado, here's part two of the video editing tutorial. Hope you guys like it. What's going on guys? This is Jay from Camp Collab. It's where I collab with other artists, make something happen. Anyway, uh, this is another tutorial another um, editing tutorial per se again we have Emily basically this this is all in Phoenix by the way all the Emily edits are all shot in Phoenix it was a good time um, so this is basically her and her jumpsuit and we sat on this kind of, this is the um, the exit of a parking. So, it was a good look. Uh, I like this, but let's get another one. I like, I really like this. So this is very moody. Um, let's get on with it. Let's see if it's sharp. Yep, uh, it's fairly sharp. It is sharp. It's sharp. It's good. So first thing I'm gonna do, make sure it's straightened. Straighten. It's fairly straightened. Again, um, I can't. I thought. I think that this is going to be a good time for the, for the this this look, because um, there's no harsh sun that was uh, raising up. Uh, that's that's highlighting her, and I kind of want to cut off her her feet here, but I love her reaction here. So. We're gonna play with this. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just warm it up a little bit. Um, put the expo. This just a little bit. Um, Clarity up. Uh, everything's pretty much almost the same. Um, but when I already have my presets, just some minor minor details. Mask off. Masking off. Luminance off. Distortion. Let's see, I want it that way. Vignette. Yeah, I want to focus on her hair. Hair, her face, basically on a. The better part of um, the better upper part of this photo. Um, since we're gonna post probably post this on Instagram, might as well crop it the right way for Instagram, which is four or five, and crop it like that. Boom, boom. That's dope. All right. So adjustment wise. This is really sad. This is very moody. Um, I want to see if uh, I can. There we go. That's done. Beautiful. That's good. And um, sharpening again. Noise. Nothing. 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 So I want to make her a little taller or appeal appear taller. Vertical up. Aspect up maybe lower this a little bit still keep the natural look so it's a little more um with the within the, the third the the rule of thirds very straight very um symmetrical here and this is where it's um it's a little bit of a, a challenge the highlights so with the color, um, 
I see that it lights up the the vignette, but with the highlight it darkens it up. I guess um, there's a lot of highlights in this in the outsides of outsides of her body of her face. So I can just kind of just appeal to that. I know the midpoints is is kind of harsh right now. So let's go back to the color. No, I think I like the mids better. So it really puts emphasis on her reaction in her face as opposed to hmm. yeah this is this is well this is better only because I want like something heavy and something that weighs on herself to put that in the picture and and not worry about the more the I noticed that in photography the more light you emphasize on on the subject the more the eyes are attracted on that those those lights so the less light the less attention and people just go towards see right here when I take out some of the highlight the the um the vignettes um there's a lot of attention on a lot of things but i take it down it's just her i used to hate doing um vignettes on my photos but i now see the purpose of it and i appreciate the vignettes more so grain 25 the haze Maybe this is different. This is very moody. So one or two. Um, hmm. See if this makes a difference. Less red, more orange. A little more orange. Just to have a a more pleasing and not so hot look. Um, I know that if I put this blue, it's really good. The the teal brings out more teal, and the the oranges turns a little more red, but it's not too too harsh. So I think I'm happy with this edit uh, before and after. Very dull, very uh, underexposed, and then a little more refined here very vintage um and see if uh, there's any changes that i could do oh it's very good look at this boom yeah that's not what it's about it's not what it's about all right it's about Let's see if uh, putting more blacks could make it better. No, guess not. Contrast. No. As far as taking away the fade, it looks good. Taking away less fade still looks good, but we keep it real. Fade is up. Now we just gotta twerk work work on a little more of her um her spots on her face which is fine uh it's not a whole lot just these little ones see easy does it nothing to it all right. Cool. I think that's it. Just a little touch up. No, not dodge. Let's do um, soften skin. Not too much. Definitely no sharpen. 
and so when you want to blend some uh, irregularities on the shading I know I do so boom 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 and If you guys like this video, please smash that like button, comment if you have any questions down in the comment section below. I will try to post a video either Wednesday or Thursday, somewhere in, in the middle of the week so you guys can try something new on the weekends. And again, my name is Jay, host of Cam Collab, it's where I collab with other artists to make something happen. See you guys next time.